always try to bring the nature of the land in my work. I come from eastern part of India. The place is called Tripura. I used to go with my father to the jungle often. And uh, the most important thing that I remember that how I used to see is, is from a top of the hill and uh, seeing it. So it's a kind of vast area um, of uh, nature that I could see. When I came to Kolkata, the place is called uh, Salt Lake, where it was a marshy land and kind of fishery before. That it was totally bare land and hardly any houses were around. But gradually, everything has changed. It has become very crowded, a kind of concrete jungle. The large scale works, probably it comes the kind of uh, uh, land that uh, I have seen, the kind of openness I have seen. This I wanted to have it in front of me, that it can uh, stand in front of me, and uh, a huge area that which can also cover that the scene areas. Even for the larger paper work, I followed a kind of very traditional uh, technique, that is. Uh, for traditional tempera painting, there were several layers of paper on a fabric cloth and all thin, very thin papers I used, like tissue paper and Nepali paper. Whatever the length and uh, width I wanted to uh, make, I could uh, go on adding, uh, adding papers and cotton fabric. At the same time, there were many more uh, different kind of papers, like brown paper, or the newspaper to create texture. Because as a painter, I normally use very thick uh, paint. I, I wanted to have a kind of substitute of that in my paperwork. Then in every layer, I, I did put many uh, marks and uh, textures and painted layer. I have also used uh, natural pigments like tea stain, coffee stain, sometimes sand also I have used. For the paintings, it happens like this. I put the glue and the paper and my material and all. And then after, say, about 12 hours, uh, I'm seeing the result. The way I work, it is not that I could plan it uh, right in the beginning and uh, I could follow it. Always for my work, I found that uh, things are coming as a surprise to me all the time. Actually, the way I am working is almost uh, like uh, the witnessing the kind of things that are happening around. What's happening in front of me? What are the changes of that particular land? Initially, it's for me. And then if the message is uh, convincing, then everybody can read it.